A breakthrough tonight for victims of gun violence in our state. Governor J.B. Pritzker will sign a bill to help hold reckless gun manufacturers and advertisers accountable in court. CBS2 investigator Megan Hickey live for us with what this means for victims and their families. Megan. Right, Marie and Erica, legal experts tell me this law is really intended to encourage gun manufacturers and dealers to act responsibly because now it will be easier for the victims of gun violence to sue them in the state of Illinois. Last fall, survivors and families of victims of the 4th of July shooting in Highland Park filed lawsuits against Smith & Wesson. All right, eyes and ears. Pointing to the gun makers That's advertising, right. even the company's right. YouTube page. Hello. So there you have it, guys. MEP 1522. No excuse not to own one. For allegedly appealing to young men like the Highland Park shooter to, quote, effectively execute their violent fantasies. There's an attitude in the gun industry that they're not responsible for what happens with their products. David Pacino, deputy chief counsel for Giffords Law Center to Prevent Gun Violence, tells me that the Gun Violence Victims Access to Justice bill, which passed both houses this week and is on its way to Governor Pritzker's office to sign, would make it easier for victims of gun violence and their families to take this type of legal action in the state of Illinois. There's an explicit exception in the federal statute that says if a gun company is breaking state law, they don't get any protection. This legislation amends our current Consumer Fraud and Deceptive Businesses Act to clarify that businesses in the firearms industry are subject to civil liability if they engage in unlawful business and marketing practices. Illinois joins a handful of other states with this type of clarification, including New York, California, New Jersey, Delaware, and Hawaii. And Puccino explained that it's not just mass shooting survivors who could benefit. Some of them there are very highly publicized mass shootings and some of them don't even make the paper, but this is a path for them to be able to get the accountability that they deserve, to get the compensation that they deserve, and to get some measure of justice. Now, Governor J.B. Pritzker released a statement saying this legislation finally protects Illinoisans from predatory actions from the firearms industry. We did check in with his office for an update on when it could be signed. They said right now that timeline is still up in the air. Marie and Erica. We know you'll follow it. CBS2 investigator Megan Hickey. Megan, thank you.